Buster, are we there yet? Well, according to my calculations, it's just around the next help. <laughs> Not a moment too soon. I'm turning into a mousesicle out here. <laughs> Bless you. Tell me again, why are we going to Dusselschnorf? That's Oberndorf, Chauncey, where we will find fame and fortune. It's Christmas in Oberndorf, a very special season. So jolly in Oberndorf, and Christmas is the season. It's snowing in Oberndorf, and all the bells are ringing. So noisy in Oberndorf. <laughs> In Oberndorf, a very special season. A long way to Oberndorf, and I am to the freezing! <laughs> Bless you. Hey, Buster, why are we in Oberndorf? This is our once-in-a-lifetime chance, Johns. The Queen is coming to this town for Christmas Eve. So tomorrow night, we, Buster and Chauncey, Austria's greatest musicians, will perform for her. She'll love us! Think of all the music we will play. Think of all the money we will get. Giving people pleasure every day. Chauncey, this could make our fortunes Think yet. Think how much we'll give. Think how much we'll get. Rich and famous. Lovely music. Fat and comfy. Christmas music. Chauncey, what I mean. Buster, what I mean. Is let's go see the let's queen. Let's go see the queen. We're cheery in Oberndorf. Oh, what a celebration. And weary. In Obendorf, from all the preparation for this year, in Obendorf, the queen is on her way for Christmas in Obendorf. So hurry up, no time to spare. She's almost here. We're, We're almost, almost there. there. The Christmas spirit's in the air. Do you really think the Queen wants to hear us play? Well, of course. Why wouldn't she? We are the masters of magnificent melodies, the mouse crows of major magnitude, able to play Mozart, Schubert, Beethoven. Bless you. Okay, can I do my new song? Oh, Johns, Johns, my lad, that, that's much too, uh, quaint. You know, we, we need something with lots of those little black dots and the squiggly lines all over the sheet music. You mean notes? Yeah, zillions of them. That's why we important musicians should play a real showstopper, like this big number. Buster, there it is. You did it! You found it! A nice, warm town for Christmas, with plenty to eat, I'll bet. Oh, food! Enough already. My stomach growled so loudly a few minutes ago, I thought it was the abominable snowman. 
Wow, Buster, you really are hungry. What were you stampeding, my good mouse? Wait a minute. You guys are going the wrong way. Run for your lives! Sorry, but we're going to Oberndorf. No, not Oberndorf! It's in Oberndorf! The meanest cat in the whole wide world! A monster! You won't find food! You'll be food! Whatever you do, stay away from Oberndorf! Buster, are you sure we should go to Oberndorf? Jones, my friend. Believe me, we got nothing to worry about. Buster? Buster! I'll find you, Buster! Am I come close? Give me a signal! Am I close? Huh? Huh? Am I? Good signal. <laughs> Just as I planned. <clears throat> right to our stop. Oh, what a ride, Buster. Oh, I'm telling you, Chauncey. This town is a dream come true. <laughs> oh, uh, 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 St. Nicola Church welcomes Queen Therese to view our golden treasure of the three wise men. Well, there's something I didn't know. Oh, you mean that the Queen will be visiting this church and its golden treasure? No, I didn't know you could read. <laughs> That's cute. Oh, we gotta find some place to practice. Oh, maybe practice can wait. What is it, Buster? Shots. Either my nostrils are hallucinating, or I smell food. Let's go. Well, just do like I do and follow your nose. Buster, is it possible to not follow your nose? Welcome. We have plenty of warm soup for everyone. Merry Christmas to all. Well, hello there. Would you like some soup? Thank you, Father. <laughs> have some bread, dear. <laughs> Oops, thank you. <gasps> bingo! Gee, Buster, I love bingo! I-16, 057, B4! B4, your eyes, young chance, lies a magnificently plump and delicious crumb with our names on it. But what about that cat? <laughs> Let him find his own crumbs. It's good soup, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yes, Father, it is. My name's Father Joseph. What's your name? Christina. Well, Christina, where will you and your parents be spending this Christmas? Well, I... I'm not sure yet. Um, is there any more soup? Of course. It's delicious and hot. Ah, uh, nearly as good as a home-cooked meal. Merry Christmas. I wish I had a home. Must be pound cake. 
Excuse me, Featherbrain? I wonder if you might remove your claws from my morsel? Excuse me, my furry little friend. Are you sure you really want me to drop it? Absolutely. Well, if you're sure, have a nice trip. See you next fall. <laughs> Never fear, lunch is here. Resourceful little fella. He's Buster, and I'm Chauncey. We're here to play for the Queen and live in the lack of luxury. Right, Buster? Yeah, that's lap of luxury, Chance? Yeah, right. They call me Fritz. You guys better find a place to stay before that cat comes back and decides to have Chris Mouse dinner. Anyway, gotta fly. Keep cool. As if that was a problem in this weather. <laughs> <laughs> that guy's for the birds. I'm scared, Buster. What if that monster cat comes after us again? He could be sneaking up on us right now. <laughs> Buster! Cat! <laughs> oh, you poor little deer. Don't be afraid, little fellow. Let me help you. <sighs> there you go. <laughs> and here's your friend. <laughs> Poor dears, you're trembling. Here, this will keep you warm. Merry Christmas. Buster, you were right. This is the lap of luxury, and that queen sure is nice. Oh, Chance, you knucklehead. <laughs> She's not the queen. The queen is a majestic lady in elegant clothes who rides around in a fancy coach. You mean like that one? Yeah, like that. Uh, uh, the, the, the queen. Oh, the queen? Oh, no. No, she not due until tomorrow. <laughs> Welcome to Oberndorf, Your Majesty. I beg your pardon. Oh. Yes, well, you see, I, I thought you were... <laughs> Actually, we are here early to check out security for Her Majesty's arrival. I am the Duke of Rausch, and this is my niece, Lady Gretchen. My dear. Uh, well, uh, Your Ladyship, allow me. <clears throat> I am Obendorf's mayor, Burgermeister Wilhelm Hoffenmeier, at your service. Herr Burgermeister, I'm delighted to meet you. We appreciate your cooperation, and I'm sure the Queen will be happy to hear of your eagerness to help. <laughs> it never hurts to have Uncle Otto put in a good word. When can we start? Isn't this the church where the golden treasure is kept? Yes, yes, the, the golden treasure is kept here. Uh, but, but, but I can't show it to you. I, no one is allowed near it, you see. Oh, well, if you can't. Well, actually, <laughs> it probably wouldn't hurt to take one quick peek. <laughs> well, let us tour the church, and then we shall look in on the golden treasure. Chance, it is time we found a comfy mouse hole in this church. You lead, and I'll follow. But, Buster, it's dark, and I'm scared. How about the other way around? All right, I'll follow, and you lead. Oh, that's better. Impressive silver work, Herr Hoffenmeier. Yes, we pride ourselves on our collection of... Huh? Heavens, I just realized... We've no arrangements for your stay. Oh, I, I, I must run to the inn. Please make yourselves ow! at home. Uh, light a candle. Help the needy. Oh, that we will. This is going to be easier than I thought, Uncle Otto. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's nothing like the Christmas season. If you are the criminal type It's our favorite time of year and here's the reason The pickings are so criminally ripe Burger, bandit, pickpocket The gross receipts, skyrocket When the Christmas cap 
world is a thrilling. All the greedy pockets will be filling. It's the time of year to make a killing. Christmas is a holiday for thieves. While they're hanging up a Christmas stocking, we'll be at the treasure chest and barking. Eyeing all the loot, now you're talking. Shocking. What's a jolly holiday for thieves? The candles on the tree are twinkling. The Christmas goose is being sliced. <laughs> and the city fools <laughs> are not hanging. We're pulling off the greatest heist. When they're snuggled in their beds and sleeping, back into the church will go creeping. When they wake, the whole town will be weeping. <laughs> That's why every crook we know believes. Do your dirty work on Christmas Eve. Christmas is a holiday. <laughs> Your charitable conduct is certainly appreciated. Chauncey, <laughs> <laughs> uh, not that I'm the least bit tired, but uh, do you have any idea how much longer? I don't know. Then uh, are we at least going the right way? I don't know. Well, what do you know? I don't know. Hey, Buster, what's that over there? I don't know. Oh, no, you got me to it. <gasps> oh. Amazing! 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 <laughs> Listen, there are still other mice in town. Hello! I'm Chauncey! Hello! I'm Chauncey! Wow, Buster. Hello. Who'd have thought there'd be another Chauncey here? <laughs> another Chauncey? Oh. <laughs> All right, everyone, quiet down. Tonight is dress rehearsal. This is our last chance to make sure everything is perfect before the Queen arrives. And now we come to our 12th painting by Tiepolo, one he was finished at Würzburg back in 1753 before the fire. Uh, Herr Hoffmeyer, this is fascinating. But our time is valuable. Valuable? <laughs> Let me tell you, these paintings are nothing compared to... Herr Fraser, Herr Hoffenmeier. Right? Oh, it's, yes. Uh, would you like to see that now? What? First, let me mention this very fine painting. Notice the Magi's gifts. So, Franz, how's the pipe organ? Marvelous, my friend. It may be old, but it has never looked so grand or sounded so pure. Hello again, Christina. Would you like to be a part of our pageant? That, that would be wonderful. Could I? <laughs> of course. Come, let me introduce you to Franz Gruber, our choir master. Excuse me, Franz. This is Christina. Couldn't we use another helper in our pageant? Christina. A superb name for one of our angels. <laughs> oh, oh, Chance, Chance. I have found our abode. No, 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 no. Look. Way up there. Hot air rises, does it not? <laughs> As I thought, it's only a mirror. <laughs> oh! <sighs> Once more, I have led us over all obstacles to arrive safely at a warm and comfortable dwelling. But no buts about it. There is now nothing to come between us and our triumphant performance before the Queen. But, but nothing, I repeat, nothing can stop us now. But what about that cat? Oh, don't bother yourself with such fierce thoughts. Concentrate on practicing for the Queen. <sighs> Remember, practice, practice.
like my song better. Huh. Oh no. Where's my spare string? I know I had it. Oh, Buster, where am I gonna find a new string? Buster? <laughs> there. These wings are the perfect size. <laughs> Brunhild, won't this room be empty after the pageant? Yes, Father. Uh, now, if you'd excuse me, a shepherd needs his cloak mended. Christina, would you like to stay here? Really? You mean this could be my room? I've never had my own room before, but only for a short time. I'm going to Vienna. Vienna? That's an awfully long trip in the middle of winter. My aunt and uncle live there. I'm going to live with them, if they'll have me. And where are your parents? My parents? They both got sick. They never got better. I'm all alone now. I'm sorry, Christina. You know, I grew up without my parents, too. Then you're an orphan like me? Yes, I am. I like this room. Oh, there's even a shelf for my things. Well, you get settled. Thank you, Father. A button on a string. A heart-shaped piece of stone. The doll that's been my only friend since I've been on my own. They've come so very far and stayed through thick and thin. These things that I've collected to remind me where I've been. Now I'll collect that moon and I'll collect that star. Road. They'll shine so very clear These things that I collected To remind me I was here Their pillows feel so soft And people seem so kind And every fear seems far behind My star is in the sky so beautiful to see and maybe it will lead me to my home and family yes maybe something wonderful will finally come to me whole basket of strings. Uh, uh, this door leads to the organ loft and uh, uh, this one to the room with the pipes. Her Majesty can request the show. Treasure is safe in our secret hiding place. Ooh. They are just like the magnificent gifts which the wise men brought to the manger. Simply priceless. So, as you can see, oh, they are yeah. fashioned out of the finest gold. And <laughs> there is only one key. Such a clever governor. Oh, no, I am merely the burgomaster. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Dear me, a mouse! No! Not a mouse! Ah! Oh, don't worry, my ladyship, you're safe with me. The broom! Use the broom! You can count on me! Oh, I'm sure it's gone now. But thank you. <laughs> 
No! There he goes! <laughs> Don't catch that mouse! <laughs> Delinquent. <gasps> she could be a spy. No, I'm not. I promise. Yeah. Oh. 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 Where did this come from? And a thief. You have a lot of explaining to do. We know what to do with young thieves like you. Did you hear that? He knows what to do with thieves. Yeah. Such a shame, though, he doesn't know who the real thieves are. Chauncey, 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 you're supposed to be practicing your violin, not the organ. But, Master, we got trouble. Cat trouble. Majesty, think of me! Oh, no, not the organ, too. My career is ruined. Christmas is ruined. You little street urchin, it's all your fault! The poor box is empty. Father Joseph, this child is a thief. She was spying on me. And now, look at the poor box! She had the coins in her possession! Christina, how do you explain this? Father, I'm telling the truth! And just look at this mess she caused! The pageant is beyond repair! Mm. It's awful dear for you, young lady. Herr Huffenmeyer, it's Christmas. Surely you can allow the child to stay here at the church till after the holiday? I'll take full responsibility for her. <clears throat> Very well, then. I trust you will deal with her sternly. Father Joseph, you've got to believe me. Christina, look at this mess. So much work by so many people. Ruined. Why don't you just go back to your room? Stay there. 
you're my responsibility now, and you're not to leave this church. Fine. Nobody ever believes me. What am I going to do? <laughs> Christine is in a lot of trouble because of me. Now I feel like we should help her. They don't need me to be an angel. I don't deserve to be here. Father Joseph was so kind to me. And look what I did to him. The best Christmas gift I can give him is to leave. My, my locket! Where is it? Buster, look. Christina is leaving her room. Father Joseph asked her to stay there. Forget about the girl. I can't just forget about her. Well, sure you can. I can. Well, here, watch, watch. Gone. Nothing. Now, about her performance. Sorry, Buster, but Christina's making a big mistake. I need to help her. What's gotten into you? Have you forgotten what we came? Christina saved me from that cat, Buster. She's what Christmas is all about. Helping others. I'm not giving up our dream for some lost kid. If you walk out on me now, don't come back. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't have a choice, Buster. My heart tells me that sometimes a mouse has got to do what a mouse has got to do. Goodbye, Buster. Well, go ahead. Who needs you? Merry Christmas, Buster. I'll bet it's here someplace. Oh, thank goodness. What are you doing with the treasure? Quiet, little girl. Gretchen, darling, we can't afford to leave any witnesses. No. Yes, and wouldn't it be a pity if that nice Herr Hoffenmeyer thought she wasn't even bigger? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> oh! That's my locket. Yes, isn't it, my dearest little darling? Your locket and this key will be the perfect clues for that bumbling burgermeister. No! Whoa! <laughs> Quick! Out the big way! Mm. Oh no! What are they doing? Buster? Oh, no, Buster. I'm on my own. No, I'm not alone. And I've got to help her. What is it, Herr Hoffemeyer? <laughs> the treasure! <sighs> it's her locket, all right. And this is your key. Oh, dear, the treasure is stolen! This is beyond terrible, beyond ruin! Father, that girl is a crook! our cover will be blown. We need new identities to slip out of town. Darling, did you know I can tell fortunes and predict the future? I see a gypsy and her mysterious husband. One day they find a treasure in an old bar. And live happily ever after. <laughs> We'll need a wagon. Watch the girl while I find one. Hurry, darling. You'll never get away with it. 
Don't be foolish, silly child. We already have. Oh, neat. I can do it all by myself blindfolded. Ow! To my pal Buster, may this scarf keep you as warm as our friendship. Merry Christmas, your pal Chauncey. Oh. It's beautiful. I really miss the little guy. I let him go off alone. Oh, how could I? I was too busy thinking only of myself. Well, he was up in a poor orphan. And the one time he needed me, I let him down. I'm not a mouse. I'm a rat. That's what I am. Maybe I did have it all wrong. And the real meaning of Christmas isn't fame and fortune. It's, it's friends who are true. It's about sharing, not getting. Giving to others and giving of yourself. Johns, I really miss you. How did your song go? Franz, have you been here all night? Joseph, my friend, the Queen arrives soon. And what are we to do? I've been thinking. The pageant, the Queen, Christina. Maybe we've lost sight of the true meaning of Christmas. Franz, we must never forget what is truly important. And maybe if we open our hearts to that, everything will work out fine. <laughs> Father, a melody is dancing in my head. Is it a miracle? I don't know, but I hear it too. Here, t take a look at this. Last night, it was so peaceful. It was such a silent night that I wrote these verses as I prayed for Christina's safety. Wondrous words, divine inspiration. Set these words to music. And Christmas may be saved after all. Where are you going? To find Christina and tell her that I believe in her. <sighs> the only thing more beautiful than that song is my pal himself. Chance is out there somewhere. And my buddy needs me! <laughs> hey, hey, you! Put me down! Pipe down, pal. You've got a furry friend to find, right? Yeah? Well, I thought I'd share a little Christmas spirit. See if you can spot him from up here. Look! I say, I missed you. <laughs> Once a partner, always a partner. <laughs> Besides, I had to thank you for the scarf. You're welcome, partner. Whoa! Run! Uh -huh. Come back here, you little ragamuffin. Woohoo! <laughs> now I have proof. We've got to stop her! Ah, forget the girl. Who will believe her? Father Joseph! Christina! Oh, thank God you're safe. Possible. There is the thief! No, look, I have proof! Aha! My key, the locket, the coins from the pool box, and now this bit of treasure! I'm afraid it's painfully clear, Father! Arrest her! Just go nice and slow. The bad guys are getting away, Buster! We've got to do something! <laughs> Just watch me. Let's hope that filthy feline sticks to his sworn duty. Hey, Fuzzface! Coughed up any good furballs lately? 
Christina, I knew it wasn't you. Can you forgive me? Can I still be an angel? You always will be. <gasps> How could you do this to me? Constable, arrest these two! <laughs> Buster, where are you? I really gotta get rid of this cold. Buster! My goodness, the queen! Everybody to the church! I would like to thank all of you for coming. Especially Her Majesty the Queen. Our service tonight will be very simple. Our choir master, Franz Gruber, will play guitar. And I will sing because, unfortunately, our pipe organ is broken. But this Christmas Eve service isn't for any of us. It's for the one who was born on this night. A very special child. For I have recently discovered just how much you can learn from a child about love Truth and forgiveness. Buster, he's playing my song. Must be a miracle, Chance. Silent night, holy night. All is calm, all is bright. You know, guys, that tune's kind of catchy. Well, I gotta be flying. See you all in the new year. So long, Fritz. My little angel. Yes, your majesty. I understand that you have an aunt and an uncle in Vienna. Why, yes, your majesty. Vienna is my home. Perhaps you could accompany me there. And together we will find your family. Oh, yes, thank you. I just need to say goodbye to some friends. You keep warm, get plenty to eat, and avoid all cats. Oh, 
Here's a little something for you to remember me by. Ah. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Buster, I'm sorry we never got a chance to play for the Queen. Eh, I think I read someplace she doesn't like accordion music anyway. So, here's my new idea. We travel from town to town playing your song. <laughs> Who knows? It might catch on. And then we could tell all the mice the story of how it started, huh? Merry Christmas, Buster. Merry Christmas, Chauncey.